Phil, it's been promised as a long, hot, dry summer, and even though we've had a bit of rain, it's still biting. Uh, absolutely, Rob. Um, the view was that El Nino was going to bring extraordinarily dry conditions. It's almost the biggest on record in terms of El Ninos. Um, and certainly dry is something that is true of most of the eastern parts of New Zealand. There was rain in November, there was rain in uh, January, a little bit in December, but still not enough. I mean, conditions are still very dry out there. But it's greened up, which must confuse some people. That's right. Uh, even though uh, grass is green, that doesn't necessarily mean that it's actually productive. Uh, it can be green without actually doing anything, and that's one of the risks that we currently run, is that people look at the grass and say, oh, well, it's green. Mm. That doesn't mean that when you actually have livestock eat that, that in fact you're going to get production coming back. One of the things flying over Canterbury is you see these huge rings. You don't need to have irrigation just going in circles. No, well, that comes back very much to the cost of land. Uh, land, land is an expensive uh, asset for any farm. Uh, and there are a number of uh, opportunities now to fill in those corner spaces uh, to actually cover the piece of land 100% in terms of irrigation. Uh, and that then means that, in fact, it's all productive. And really you shouldn't see the round circles of a pivot, you should actually see an entire property being green and productive. You don't sow a paddock in a circle, you do it in a square or an oblong. Yes, yeah, certainly, uh, you know, we're in a position now where in fact uh, with modern irrigation techniques we can actually cover every last piece of that land. Um, and certainly the opportunity exists. We've got products that fit very nicely into that. Lots of pivot corners have been done in the past with K-Line and that's very effective. Uh, and of course we've now got uh, g set irrigation which covers situations where labour's not as plentiful. plentiful. Uh, we can do g set in corners in unusual shapes. Uh, every one of those is individually controlled. We can uh, ramp up the amount of water or diminish it. Uh, very, very effective. So you can do directional? to a degree as well. Um, so I mean, there are lots of possibilities. Phil, we've come a long way with irrigation. And there's still a long way to go. Um, K-Line over many, many years has uh, had some poor management along the way of some farmers where they've actually over irrigated. Uh, we can see a time where irrigation control will come into K-Line. Uh, where we can uh, measure the amount of water applied and the amount of water actually absorbed into the soil. So the future is very, very bright for the irrigation industry and for RX as a result of that. K-Line used to be scoffed at by some people, but it's really come into its own now, hasn't it? It's gone mainstream. Oh, absolutely, yeah. It's all about uh, earning the most off the land. Uh, it's one of the highest assets you have, and it's a matter of getting the best return from all of those areas and K-Line has fitted very well into that over a long time. Uh, and it's relatively inexpensive on capital as well, so that really does give it great opportunity. Is GSET catching on? Uh, GSET's actually doing reasonably well. Um, it's always difficult when you have a product which is relatively high capital cost. Uh, it doesn't fit every situation. Something that's low capital cost fits everywhere. Um, so uh, the future is good for GSET. It takes some time, however, for people to accept that um, solid set uh, is, a, is a reasonable solution for those areas. Um, so time tells all stories, but it's going very, very well. Now I guess there's a setup time. Do you have to give it much lead? The reality is that it's going to take time to do the design for the system and the implementation. Uh, that's always always in the back of your mind, so uh, it's not an instant fix. Uh, usually you're looking at a three month lead time to actually get that product installed uh, from the start of the design through to implementation. Music